Hey everybody, it is I, Rocky, coming back for another video. No, I don't look that great, I'm sorry. <laughs> Guys, I really don't, I look like horrible actually, right now, because I'm not, I'm not, I don't have, I'm not dressed all that great, so I'll look kind of bad, but oh well, it's all right, it's okay. I'll make it through it, all right? Guys, I wanted to do this video to tell you that I'm really worried about Lucas and where he is. Um... We went on Amazon to track him, and there's no... All I know is he was shipped out Monday. That's all I know. I know no where he is or anything, and I'm really worried about him. I shouldn't be, but I am. I'm worried about my little boy. I mean, first of all, before I get into that, I wanted to um, say welcome to Carolyn. She subscribed to me. Thank you for subscribing. And also to... Lakita, 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 yeah, Lakita, Lakita, what's wrong with me? She is my counselor I go to, she's really nice, and I heard, I told her about the channel, so, I mean, I'm excited, I want this baby to come so I can hold him, I want to show him to my friends, I want him to see his Uncle Byron, and his Aunt Robin, his Uncle Jackie, and Uncle Ezra, his Aunt Lena, his Aunt Sarah, you know, all the people I love and want to share him with, I want him to see that. And I want him to see, you know, be on YouTube with me and Daniel. Um, I do have a question, you guys out there. You reborn parents who can tell me. I have a question. Um, my question is this. Have you ever had a reborn child get jealous of another? Because I don't want Daniel jealous of Lucas because I'm showing him to my friends or I'm showing him, you know, taking him somewhere. Because Daniel's the one that loves to go. He... You know, for a long time, we go everywhere with me. There was not a place Daniel didn't go as far as, like, you know, when I go on trips or whatever. Um, and I'm kind of sad because, like, I really want to show him and, you know, take him to my school reunion next year and to camp with me. But I'm also afraid of upsetting and making Daniel kind of jealous. So you reborn parents out there, tell me what you think about that. Because I'm... <sighs> That's the word I am like. Ah. Anyway, um, I'm gonna go to church pretty soon. <sighs> Sorry, y'all. I'm gonna go to church pretty soon and get a little church in me. Um, what I love about my church, they understand about my babies. Like, if I tell them to pray for a safe, safe, safe arrival, they do. They always do. They don't just humor me. They actually do pray for for the, the arrivals. So, um, David took about two weeks to arrive. I'm hoping that's all this one takes, or maybe less. But I don't know. There's no estimated, as you you know, as you know, the delivery date is like uh, between October 20th and November 7th. And I don't know if I can be away from him that long. I'm so excited. I want to hold him. I want to change him. I want to... All those things that I did with when I got Daniel, I want to do with him. And Daniel is really jumping and excited. He wants to know where his brother is, and I can't tell him. And he got really disappointed. He was like, Mom, where's my brother? Where's my brother? Where's my brother? I'm like, baby, I don't know. I don't know, you know. Um, in the virtual world, we always say that the caseworker is uh, going to get the baby, the boy from the place he's in and bringing him to me. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, those of y'all who don't know about my channel, uh, who haven't been here before, welcome to my channel. Um, I'm Rocky. Well, that's my nickname. I'm 43 years old. I'm blind, autistic, and epileptic. And I have several reborn babies. Um, the reason I do is because, um, I went through a lot of really hard times, and this is my way of coping with it, and it helps me to really have anxiety to walk with them, or hold them, or change them, or, you know, talk about them, or, you know, film with them. It helps a lot. I'm not sure how well you're going to see me, because, unfortunately, you're vertical, so you might want to make your phone go to the full screen, because it's, right now it's vertical. Um, let me see, lay it down. Okay, there we go. Maybe that might work. I don't know if you can see me or not. Just let me know if you do see me. 
Um, trying to get comments to work. It's not working very well. I have no idea why. I'm gonna know that just. Um. I'm really tired. I didn't. Uh, I slept, but it was kind of broken. And I'm still tired from yesterday because it was a long day. I'm gonna be more tired next Thursday because we're gonna be going to Coolidge Park, which I can't wait. I'm excited. I might try to actually film at Coolidge Park, so. Especially if I get my new phone by then. Oh, I'm definitely filming at Coolidge Park then. Um, but, yeah, I just, I'm frustrated because I really want to know where my little guy is. Make sure he's safe. Yeah. Ugh, gosh. And there's no information on this on this baby. I know he's made from angel baby dolls. I know that. That's all I know. No skull. What? I don't know. Scared me half to death. Anyway, just, um... Guys, keep me your thoughts and prayers and everything. I'll let you know as soon as I know where he is. I love you guys. What's up?